the High Man back with another DC, it's more of a Funko Legion of Collectors box, and this is for the month of July. This is a Suicide Squad based uh, Legion of Collector box. So you can see it's got the um, packaging right here of Harley Quinn, the silhouette, and it's got, it even has a tattoo of Rotten right there. So you can see this is a Legion of Collectors, so it's got that all around there all the way around and this says Funko right on the back. So if you guys want to pick this up, click in the link in the description. I will post for uh, the Legion of Collectors so you guys can still pick up this month's box. Also, if you guys missed out, there is the Batman versus Superman one that you can still pick up as well. And I did a review on this one. Click in the, uh, or not click in the link in the description, but look at my previous videos. I just did it recently. So this is the box right here. We're gonna open this bad boy up. Really excited for this one. I've got my scissors here. So we'll make a little cut there, and then we'll open, open it up, and then we're gonna. I'm gonna pull everything out of the bag or out of the box, and I'll show you guys some close-ups on everything here. Woo! All right, so let's see what we got first off. So similar to like the other one, we got some patches and pins. I'll show you guys close-ups on here. So we got a dead shot pin. Uh, we have a katana Suicide Squad Legion of Collectors patch right there. And then of course the uh, packaging has a bunch of, you know, little images here of the cast from Suicide Squad. You open this flap up. Ooh. And then first things first here, let me grab it this way. So we get a comic, actually, no, we get this little card. And this is gonna tell you everything that's in there. And then here's the Legion of Collectors, it tells you the website and whatnot. So we have the comic Suicide Squad, Legion of Collectors, issue number one. And it's got Harley Quinn in Funko Pop form. So you can see that's pretty cool. Uh, we have the shirt. Now the shirt, this is something I was really excited to pick up or to get. So the size large, perfect. This is really cool. Now I'm debating on whether to wear this during the Suicide Squad uh, premiere. And it's soft, just like the material I love. So we got a Funko style image right here or artwork of Suicide Squad. So that's really cool. I like the color too, not a bad color. So it'll fit me good. So we have that. We also have two Funko figures, right? These look like they're like almost a reaction style figures, three and three fourth uh, scale figures. We have Joker and Harley Quinn. Now these look a little bit on the silly side, but it's still a cool display to have right here in my collection. Um, I will be doing reviews on this too, but these are quite unique. I'll show you close-ups on this. And lastly is the, the uh, exclusive Legion of Collectors Pop. This is something I really wanted from the uh, set, and that is Enchantress. So pretty much completes my set for the Funko Pops. I think, uh, as far as Suicide Squad goes, I think I just need Boomerang and Katana and Rick Flag, and I can get those um, anytime because they're not rare. But there is this pop right here. So now I'm gonna show you guys some close-ups of everything in this box. Right here, you can see the artwork inside. It just has little images of the cast members, you know, each character. There's Diablo, Rick Flag, Harley Quinn, Katana, Killer Croc. But it doesn't look like there's uh, anything of the Joker on here. So it's just pretty much just the Suicide Squad. You guys a close-up of the uh, smaller figures that you get in this packaging so here is the Joker and uh, here is Harley Quinn so these are two figures that you get I'll be doing reviews on these separately close-up of the comic that you get in here the uh, the pin and the patch that you get in this the Enchantress pop I'll show you guys a close-up here now I she comes with the base but the figure does not stand well on the base uh, at all and she's kind of hard to stand on her own, so if you can't get her to stand on the base, then, you know, good luck. But um, here's a close-up on the figure, so you can see the tattoos and the outfit that she does have. She's got a little um, uh, ankle bracelet there and then little toe rings. And you can see the makeup that's kind of, you know, dripping down her eyes. And then she's got this little, like, tiara-looking thing. And then she has long black hair. And you can see the little bow tie or whatever that is. I don't even know. It looks like a bone. But you can see the hair looks great. Overall, this is a very, very nice uh, pop. And the only way to get this version of Enchantress is to get this uh, Collector Core box set. Collector Core, or Legion of Collector Cores box for the month of uh, July. A very cool uh, box that you get with a bunch of items inside. 
Again, click on the link in the description and you guys can get yourself a Suicide Squad themed box. You can still order the Batman vs Superman one too if you guys just have to sign up and whatnot and order the boxes. And uh, I think it's definitely worth it. You get a lot of really cool items in this box. So definitely give the website a look and pick yourself up a box set. I mean, Suicide Squad is just around the corner. And get this, you know, it's, it's, it's worth it. Trust me, guys. Thanks for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up. Uh, subscribe if you guys haven't subscribed. Stay tuned. There's a lot more on the way. Peace out, guys.